four more people to answer this call, please. One, two, three, you're the last one. Listen up, everyone. Listen up. At five o'clock this afternoon, Tarek and I paced this stage with a calculator and a measuring tape. And I, and I want you to know that everyone on this stage with me right now has about as much personal space as John and Tarek and the other cellmates that they had with them for the first 30 days of detention had. <laughs> Lie down. Figure it out. This is how you sleep. Tonight we're celebrating uh, the most extraordinary coalition, and it's something Tark and I are just learning about. As Since we've been back, we've been trying to immerse ourselves, trying to catch up in all the work that you all have been doing so hard and so well. And we're to say odd is not even to start to express uh, our feelings about everything that's been done, every, uh, every effort that's been made. We, we have, of course, lots of thanks that uh, have been said a little bit earlier on. You know, I wanted to especially thank, actually, the people who came up here and who lied down. Actually, for me, that was a very powerful moment, sort of brought back a lot of what we had experienced, because genuinely, that was what we went through that first night. We didn't know how we were going to make this work. And in fact, we were one atop the other. That, that was how it worked in the end. Um, thanks especially to the, the sort of four super committee members, uh, Stephen, who is here, Mohammed, my brother, who is not here, Justin, who is not here, and Cecilia, who is also not here, all of whom just did such an incredible job keeping things under control and, and uh, watching out for us. So thank you so much to Egypt's in a moment where, the, and the Egyptian army in particular is in a moment where they're setting a new standard for stubbornness, for ruthful, ruthlessness, um, for absolute indifference to international opinion. So your stubborn uh, insistence on pushing harder and harder was the thing that ha was the thing that got us out, and I, I really think it's very true that without that extraordinarily hard pushing, we could still be in there with the other 600 arrested that day who remain in prison. So, huge, huge thanks. You didn't give up, and it worked. Mm -hmm.